What's up everybody, it's your boy Nate Dizzy here coming at you with another quick Fortnite video. Now today's video is going to be about the recent buff to shotguns that happened with patch 8.31. This was super exciting for me, that's why I'm making a video just for this uh, shotgun buff part of the patch. There was much more to the patch, it wasn't a huge update, but it was, it was significant enough to, uh, to warrant me making a video, so I'll do another video here in a bit just to talk about the patch overall because there was some really cool stuff in it. But without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Now the first thing I want to talk about is the fact that they added a new rarity of the pump and that is epic and legendary or purple and gold. This is awesome to me because I always thought it's kind of weird that there's you know the heavy which is kind of like a, a souped up version of the tack and you have then they had the double barrel and it's like that's a souped up version of nothing that was already in the game. So I thought it was really awesome that they were bringing out a souped up version of the pump. And each uh, respectively epic and legendary do 105 and 110 max damage. This is without taking critical hits into account. So if you hit a full solid body shot with all pellets making contact with the target, you'll do 105 for purple and 110 for legendary. You can find these shotguns as floor loot, in chests, supply drops, as well as in vending machines. So now we're going to start talking about the update that applies to all the shotguns in general. And the first thing I want to mention is always, always you will do at least three pellets worth of damage. Now before the update, if you hit with one pellet, you did one pellet worth of damage. If you hit with two, you did two. Now, no matter how many pellets you hit with, you will do three pellets worth of damage, taking those seven, uh, seven damage hits up to 21 damage hits. Now, I will note that you can still do seven damage, but this is because of something that I'll get to in just a minute. Now, one other note to this is that the bonus pellets cannot be critical. So if you hit a single pellet as a headshot and it does critical damage, the two added pellets will do regular base body damage. The two added pellets or one in the case of hitting with two pellets will not do the additional damage as a critical hit which basically is a damage multiplier. So in order to balance this what they did was increase the falloff range. So damage will start to decrease much sooner than it used to but in close range shotguns dominate. Along with the new rarities of the pump shotgun, they also increased the base damage of the green and blue pumps. So they increased the green from 80 to 95, and they increased the blue from 85 to 100, making it possible if you hit every pellet as a critical hit, as in like a headshot, then you will be able to one pump somebody with 200 HP. Along with this update, double barrels were removed from floor loot, so you will no longer see the double barrels sitting on the ground that you can pick up. You'll have to find them in chests, uh, supply drops, and, and so on. So now we're going to get to my thoughts and experience with this patch. I did play. The footage you're seeing is for me playing with this update, and I did actually manage to get a win, which you'll see toward the end of the video. Um, very excited about that. I got that within about five games of playing with this new patch and I can definitely say I partially attribute it to my shotguns hitting for more damage. Although you'll see that the end was a little anticlimactic and I ended up just catching the guy off guard basically. This patch is great overall. I'm a huge fan. I think it's really awesome. It should help everybody, PC and console players alike, just to actually be doing damage when using a shotgun and having less kind of RNG via factor. Um, sometimes I'll, I, before this patch I would straight miss shots and get really nice solid shots and then I would you know dead on hit the shot and not get damage. Um, I do experience the problem with ghost hits where it shows rep markers and doesn't actually do damage to the opponent which is kind of irritating but this kind of balances that because now the pumps and or well, the shotguns in general do a lot more damage. One pump is back, but I did notice that I didn't, I don't think I got one pumped since I've been playing on this patch. I don't think that it's very common because you have to literally hit every single pellet in the head and it's not that common to do that. Um, usually if you, even if you get a good solid headshot, you're hitting one or two of the pellets into the body just because of the nature of the spread of the shotguns, unless you are 
face to face, nose to nose with the person and you hit a perfect flawless shot. I think a big part of this being so balanced is because the fall off being adjusted for keeps it from being to the point where you can just snipe somebody. The shotguns are still not ridiculously accurate and basically I just feel like that they're in a good place now. I hope that they don't nerf this back at all. I hope that they leave it how it is at least for a little while at least you know a couple of patches just to see how it goes because I'm a huge fan of this. I love it and I've been really thoroughly enjoying myself. So that's about it for me. I want to I'm definitely interested in hearing anything you have to say what your experience has been with this patch. Um, I did notice if you're an Xbox player, I played with some Xbox friends and the servers on the East Coast have been bad, so we played on West Coast. If you're having problems with that, I would test that out because we had great success even with the 90 ping that we had while playing. Uh, we had great success. We got some victory royales, lots of top 10 situations in just a single uh, play session. But yeah, let me know what your experience has been in the comments and you know, like and subscribe and share if you enjoyed this video. This has been your boy Nate Dizzy bringing you another Fortnite update. And now it's time for me to say Nate Dizzy out.